Good. Okay, here we are uh, on the upper reaches of the inner glacier. Got Nick coming up, Dagmora behind, and Danny bringing in the rear, pulling up the rear, whatever it is, yeah. And I'm gonna pan, well, let's just kind of stay here while they kind of climb past. Give us a smile, Nick. Yeehaw! I'll kind of pan out. There's kind of where we came down that uh, canyon there. Jim's Degmara. Hello. It's fun. It's worth it. Got another 900 feet. We got to go till we make camp at the infamous Camp Curtis. Camp is in quotes. Here comes Danny. Someone said 90 feet. 900 feet. Oh, 90 feet. Yeah, right. Oh, it's a breeze. Okay, I'm going to pan up across here and we'll see what kind of action we get in the sun. Probably blow the thing apart, but yeah, there's a sun. Burn. Okay, that's where we're going. Right up there. And there's Justin and Nick. Okay, we got a nice big serac here, we're, or I mean uh, crevasse we're going to cross here. I'll just kind of dive down to the bottom and then take you on out. I wish I could zoom in, but the Canon G4 doesn't have that feature. Going up, over, we'll kind of maybe cruise down to see these guys. There they are. Yeah. Okay, here we are. We're just up at high camp, 12,600 feet or so. Super high camp. There's Danny, there's Justin sitting on his pack. Take a break. Oh, look at these guys. Wow, these are beavers. You know, what I like about Dag and Nick is, you know, they're digging the platform for our tent. Can you believe it? Sure, this is the only flat spot. See which way should I tilt the camera so you know it's not really flat. Well, anyway. Anyway, it's not very flat, but it's the best we could come up with. And uh, about 20 feet or 30 feet away, we have this jaws of death. Generous distance. I could lay down and... <laughs> and up the mountain we go. We're looking forward to getting some sleep tonight. And summoning tomorrow. Look at all the Ceracs above us. Well, once in a while, while traveling up, extreme slopes sometimes you have to find for the ideal campsites no the only campsite <laughs> I'm starting to like it more and more <laughs> okay we got Dagmara here is gonna go for this crevasse we're crossing the Bergstrom about 13 4 or so We're having fun. This is a playground. All right. Woo! No, I'm kind of jiggling here, trying to get a better spot here. Good job. She's up. Okay, cool. move down to here's Nick. He's all pumped. Okay, 
decide which way you want to go. Okay. Okay, Dag's up there finding a way over another crevasse that's up there while Nick goes up and uh, approaches the snow bridge. There he does it. What's it look like up there, Digmara? Well, Soft bridge? It's separated. Another shrine way above it. Hang on. Come back down. That's a beautiful big uh, berg shrine we got there and the icicles hanging off of it. Here's Danny. Hello. Now, if you guys can set some protection up there so we can all group up together while we, or unless you know where to cross, Nick and Degmara. Well. My goodness. And he's making his way up. He's up there. We're going to take the time here to pan around now. Here's kind of some more of the Bergstrom before we catch Justin coming up. The sun's pretty bright. I can't see for sure where all the where I'm shooting actually. We'll go full circle. No, on second thought, we won't. Well, yeah, we will. This will twist my rope up, but there's the valley where we came up. Coming around. So sneak down, look at some of those big seracs down there. Beautiful. 100, 100 feet tall, probably. Coming around. Now, if you just close your eyes, I'm going to make you sick. Okay, Jess is ready to go here. Using the standard self belay. Right. Is it soft enough? Nice and secure here. Video's going. Okay, here's Jess and we're gonna be crossing about a hundred foot deep crevasse. It's not very wide, but it is deep. Okay, here we are at the summit. Yeah! Nick's hooking up his uh, American flag. Looking good. Stop, baby. 12:30 on uh, Wednesday. We'll kind of give you the uh, scenic tour. There's the. Uh, we're looking from the summit down into the crater rim or crater. See the rim goes around. It goes down around, circles around to the right. Those clouds below us a little bit. Circles around to the right, comes back up. Comes over. And this past Dag will come up and meet us again. Okay, we're not going to cruise over here. There's Nick, Justin. Oh, we might as well get some close up shots. Hey, oh, hey. Boy. What do you say? My nose. Thank you, Carl. Hey. I love you, Loretta. Woo. Happy to be Hi, here. Bug. It's beautiful. You're yeah, good. it's been good. Can you see any boogers dripping out of my nose? No, <laughs> no. But we can hear you talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sneaking real fast over here. We just kind of saddle over the other side of the summit. And we're coming over there. That snow-capped peak there is the infamous Liberty Cap. And then uh, our route this time was 
down uh, down to your right. And then we'll sneak around and take a picture of Carl. Okay, hi. Okay, that's it. There they go. There it goes. Whoop, where did it go? I can't see it. Oh, it's a wreck. Yo, I, am I catching it? Yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah, ho! Well, we'll show you Nick over. He's the guy in flying it. And it's down on my head. There it is, somewhere. Have I got it? Freedom is like a kite. Yeah, flying at 14,411 feet. A kite. A little different than sea level at seaside. It's kind of like summoning a mountain. You can fly, but you got to play by the rules. Good job, Nick. The summit crater, 14,000 feet. Well, there's uh, Danny trying to keep the tent down. Out of the sun. Everybody's busily engaged. Justin's over there. Digging a platform for our tent. Nick's over there digging a platform his tent. The Barney team's doing whatever they call that. Let's see, multitasking. Dagmar is setting up the tent. Yeah. It's gonna be a great day. Has been a great day. We summited a few hours ago. Summit would be up about right, probably. Right there, you see to the left of those ro that rocky area. That's it. Okay, here's our camp at uh, 14,000 feet inside the summit crater. There's Nick over there taking down their tent, kind of surveying across the crater. You see way across there. See some climbers, more climbers over there near that opposite rim. They're coming from the DC Disappointment Cleaver route, going for the summit. go across the whole summit crater it's about who knows probably three to five hundred feet or more thick of ice we went down in steam caves last night and there was we went down uh, 150 feet vertical so solid 150 feet ice above us at that point and then there they'll make it up to the summit which is right up there that little left snow peak and there's people all over the place up here this time of the morning. 7.30 in the morning on Thursday. Okay, here we are. We're just taking a pan. We're descending now. We're partway down, getting near the Bergschrung from the summit. Panning over towards the cap right there. It's beautiful tracks. There's a team here, they just crossed a crevasse. Now we're about ready to cross the berg uh, right below them. Beautiful day. Okay, here we are. We're uh, just above the berg. We're going to do a little rappelling, nice climbing out of a crevasse. Here's Dagmara and uh, Blaine Nick, who's ready to descend. Go Whoa. for it! This is sweet! How's the ice? How's the wall? It's snow. Hard pack snow, it's uh, bad. Uh, 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 bad for ice screws? Bad, holy cow! I haven't cool. even really seen him kick in twice. It seriously just snow. I'm going to stop this video and start over again. Okay, back on. Okay. Let's look, you can see the bottom down there, huh? Of course, it might be a false bottom, just filled in a little bit. I think I might go to the bottom. In fact, I know I'm going to. Because this is bad! I can see where somebody tried to beat through that bridge. I just don't know. That would be a good day. Hold on. We should have put some friction on our own place. Better than friction.
right behind you and up to your left. Okay, we're gonna. Hey, Nick. Stop this video. Right up to your left. There's a hangar. Okay, here's Degmara. After going down and retrieving the camera that Nick left down at the bottom of the crevasse. You don't have to put that on video. It is on audio right now. Here she comes, out the top. Yes! Hey, we're not through that little situation. Good job. Thank you. Okay, let me smile. Here we go. Yeah. yeah, good job. Okay, here's Danny. Coming out. What do they call it? Uh, Chimneyan? What do you call this when they're going both sides? Stemming. Stemming. Oh, here goes Dick Myers. There's no holding on. My tape's going to run out. Good job, yeah.